Hello again folks, welcome to the next episode of Jocks playing Skyrim, the Argonian Mage. In the previous episode we cleaned out the barrow and checked up on some of the hints that you guys dropped for me, thank you very much. And um, right now I want to go and go to Talmithrin, it's that big shroom place over there. Um, and have a little chat with the elven dude, because apparently he has a black book as well. Um, and that kind of caught my interest because we found out that there's quite a few things to do with these black books. <coughs> Thus far they've been giving us boons from Hermius Mora himself. I'm not quite sure if that's a good thing or not, but thus far it seems to be an okay thing. <coughs> uh, yeah, that, that's basically it. We've been to Skyrim, got ourselves some uh, some some nice stuff such as a, uh, a bound bow and the like. I haven't been able to use it yet because there's nothing going on and I've got Taldrin still with me. He just doesn't want to let go. Hey. Uh like like I'm 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 probably gonna end trying to find a way to um ditch him I in a nice way ish. Um but yeah, I I just want him gone. I just want Serana with me. Whoa, there's some magical duels going on there. Let's meddle a little with, with those. No. Who knows if I actually hit something? I see some tentacles or something. Holy! It's a lurker! Wow, I am so bad at bow and arrow. Would be nice if Taldrin wasn't standing in my way. Whoa! Okay, well, it's it's all fun in games until something really bad happens. There we go. Interesting, these lurkers. Oh, it was another uh, f ice mage versus uh, a uh, frost mage, I'm sure. Although, I think the other one was like thrown away or something along those lines. Hey, look at that, clams. That was an uh, interesting fight. I didn't expect that to happen. And uh just 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 uh an observation. I'm really sucky at using the bow. Can I can I just like you know you guys have seen that. I'm I'm really sucky at using the bow. I might switch to something else, I don't know yet, but what uh Whoop That little spider just disintegrated Ah, this this brings back memories. Who, who's there? Who's where? I, I Whoa! Do you mind? Oh dear. Um, this is very unfortunate. Um. Whoa! 
Then expect that one to happen. Aggressive little Spriggan. Let's see who we have here. Because uh, if I'm correct, these were like travel stations, weren't they? Ah, oh, that's so cool. Ah, oh, yeah. Hello there. From that look on your face, I'm guessing you've never seen a silt strider before. Ah, uh, no. What is it? This is Dusty. I personally trained it for my lava. Feels like a lifetime ago now. I bet. Wow. He hasn't been in traveling for quite a while now. I've tried to let it go off on her own, but she insists on staying here. Doll. How do you survive out here? We get bar trade nods and ends with the locals. I've decided to stay here and make sure she passes in peace. Oh. It's the least I can do for her. Every once in a while, a local makes it out here. Although they usually just want to catch a glimpse of Dusty. Silk starters are pretty rare now. Hmm. What about about silt striders? What would you like to know? Well, why are they so rare? The blast from the volcano wiped most of them out. Okay. Found Dusty in a small cave <coughs> on the bottom fell. Silt strider cocoons are pretty tough. Uh, what were they used for? Mostly for transporting goods and people. They were pretty commonplace in Morrowind, but that was ages ago. Yeah. A silt strider carapace is so strong. It can withstand the harshest of weather. Okay. Even the legendary sandstorms of Valdenfell's Molagama region were said to barely make a dent in them. Of course, that's all ash now. Yeah. Okay, enough about this. All right. Uh, what do you have for sale? Take a look. Uh, you have mostly Kagrumas resonance gem. Hello. What is this over here? I'm 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 gonna buy this because it seems interesting and it seems useful. It's probably gonna end up being absolutely nothing of worth and I'm just you know wasting money away again. Until next time. Yep, thank you, I think. <coughs> Kagrumes. Kagrumes. I have no idea what Kagrumes is. But it sounds like a barrow or something. <coughs> So this is where that uh, that Alfie dude is residing. Hello there. I don't think you belong here. Does Master um, Neloth know about you? Are you practicing a spell? Yes, I'm trying to summon an Ash Guardian. I'm just having trouble deciphering Master Neloth's handwriting. I I don't mean to be rude, <coughs> but I need to concentrate. Okay, dude. Work. If you must know, I'm trying to get this Ash Guardian spell to work. Now let me concentrate. Oh. He just set the same. Huh? Where do I need to go? Did I just get stuck? No, 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 no. I need to go into this one. There you go. I need to go into this one. Yar, tell Mithrin. Yeah, man. There we go. Whoa. Well, hello there. Are you the welcoming committee? We don't get many visitors. Is there something you need? Well, what is this place? Tell Mithrin. It's the home of Master Neloth. <coughs> you may have heard of him. He's a famous Telvanni wizard. No. No, I don't. Um, he lives in a giant mushroom. She a smurf. In Morrowind, the Telvanni grow buildings from special fungus spores. Master Neloth grew one here to be his home. Don't ask me how. Okay. Are you one of his uh, apprentices? No. Talvis is his apprentice. I'm his steward. I manage the day-to-day -day affairs of Tel Mithrin. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm, I'm just gonna go and enter the door here. What? How does that work? It, it was an enclosed room, and there were probably way too many people in there. Okay, let's see. 
Oh! I, I float up? Um, there's nothing happening. Nope, that's that my my game is I think locked up. Gonna give it a few more. Do do do. So yeah, bugs. I'm uh, I'm thinking this might be a bug. Okay, let's uh, try loading the game again. There you go, tell me it in. Sorry about that folks, I have no idea what's going on here. Okay, so we've got the uh, the thingy mob over here. Hmm? I'm I'm trying to float. Yeah, if you'll excuse me. I'm I'm not floating. I'm stuck again. Uh, okay. Okay, folks, I'm probably going to go and pause the footage and see what's going on here. And um, maybe somehow fix it. So, one second, folks. And we're back. Uh, I fixed the issue. I just didn't need it to delete two files. I have no idea why, but here we go. Ali oop. Hello. Yes. Oh, you already talked. Mm -hmm. Go away. Um, ooh, he has interesting stuff here. Dweamer, Deathbrand, Zombies, I hear something growling. Did you guys hear that growl as well? That, 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 okay, let's just talk to Neloth and see what he's going, what he has going for me. Yo, you! Uh, you again? Didn't I see you in Ravenrock? Yeah, you did! I, you, I, I, I hear you know where to find black books. You refer to the tomes of esoteric knowledge that old Hermaeus Mora has scattered throughout the world? Yeah. Is this somehow connected to your search for Mira? Indeed. Um, I found the black book. I need to find out more. Found one? Yes. And you read it too, didn't you? Don't try to deny it. You've got the look. I can see it now. I Dangerous got to look alright. It's still knowledge and therefore useful. Usually turns out to be the most. <gasps> oh. In my he, experience. He's the guy at the stone who didn't want me to stop it. Aha. I have to know what Mirak knows if I want to stop him. Now that is a dangerous path indeed. Hermaeus Mora gives nothing away for free. That's okay. You may end up like Mirak, of course. Two power mad dragonborn. It could be very interesting. Do you know where I can find another black book? Oh yes. They're not hard to locate once you know how to look for them. I have one here that I've been using to locate more. You have a black book? Yes, I haven't been idle while this fascinating <coughs> madness engulfed Solstein. Okay. But my book isn't what you're looking for. I'm quite sure it is unconnected with this miracle. Well... But I do know where to find a black book that can help you. Why won't the book you have here help me? Oh, it is clearly not associated with the same power that has overtaken the island. And I'm not talking about Hermaeus Mora. These black books are all his, of course. Uh-huh. No, what you're looking for is a specific book. Presumably because Mirak's power derives from it. But I want to read your book, so you know where to find this black book. Yes, I do. I haven't been able to get it. But maybe together we can unlock the secrets the Dwemer left behind. Uh, I don't like him. The Dwemer, what do they have to do with this? Forbidden knowledge was somewhat of a specialty of the Dwarves, eh? You don't think they would just leave it alone, do you? It seems the ancient Dwemer discovered this book and took it to study. Okay. I found their reading room in the ruins of Nachardak. The book is there, but it's sealed in a protected case, which I wasn't able to open. Okay. But perhaps the two of us together will be able to get at the book. Yeah. Turn the child act then. The, 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 uh, the, no, 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 not yet. I, I want to see your book. Come on, let me see your book. Ah, come on. Oh, dear. Well, 
Just gonna follow him till we're outside of Whoa! I'm standing on top of him. Hi! I, I thought we were going to the Chardak. This is very confusing. So where are we going then? Uh, did he just go through the door while standing here? Oh boy. Still want to read his book though. Okay. The TV is actually here. And uh, uh, we'll call it an end to the episode right here. Come on, taking too long. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Hi. Okay, folks, that's going to be the end of this episode. So as always, I'll be right back.